and look at my lovely year 11s. Every time a new holiday arrives or a new month arrives, the exam starts to feel that little bit closer. And depending on exactly when your holidays are or when your school lets you go, you've got 25 weeks left of school. That's it. And then you leave and then you go on. And for some of you, that's going to be amazing. And for some of you, you're going to realise that you have 50 lessons left in some subjects. Now, I'm not saying this to freak you out because I still a lot, we still have lots of time to get through this, but we do start need to be laying their, their foundations for your exams. So what I want you to focus on this half term is getting them the foundations, the facts, the knowledge, the recall in place. So some of your teachers may talk to you about this is like AO1, these are all the bits you need to be able to remember from the specification, you have to remember, remember from your textbooks. So I'm going to go through a few techniques on how to actually get that stuff into your long-term memory to help you actually remember it, which is what you need to do for the exam. And then once we've remembered all the facts, then we can think about our AO2, so our application, our AO3, our evaluation. And we can't do either of those things until we can remember the facts and then we can work later on on applying them in different situations and in exam style questions. So the key thing for this half term in the lead up to Christmas is to get facts in your head. Now the best way it's been proven by science to do this is by retrieval practice. Now some of your teachers may do this um, all the time already and some of you might have never heard of this but retrieval practice is basically do short answer questions. So go and look up a fact um, and this can be in a knowledge organiser or this can be in a video and then go and answer some short answer questions about this. Now some of the textbooks that I've written they have these short answer questions in there or it could be flashcards that you've made where you're kind of like you know word meaning those are really really good or it could be multiple choice questions. Now I've got loads and loads of multiple choice questions for you all for free over on my website. You can just go watch the video, do the multiple choice questions, they're all free, they're all linked up in order. Just try and make things as easy for you as possible. But the key thing is getting those facts in there and the reason retrieval practice, whether it's doing short questions, flashcards or multiple choice questions is so effective at getting things from your short term working memory into your long-term memory is that we need to do it over and over and over again so little and often and then what I want you to do is to practice pulling that information from your long-term memory recalling it retrieving it practicing retrieving it from your long-term memory back into your working memory your short-term memory so you can actually write it down what I want you to do is to practice retrieving the information from your long-term memory on a regular basis and Practice like with anything, like with tying your shoelaces. The more you practice pulling that information out, the more you practice doing something, the better you'll get at it. So when you sit down at an exam and you see kind of like maybe a short answer question, you can practice, you've practiced pulling that information out. It's really, really quick and easy for you to do. And then when we're in the exam, it will make it a lot easier for you to, to apply that knowledge if you don't have to think too hard about the facts now. And then it's really easy for me to say, oh, you need to go and learn a lot of stuff. Um, but that is what I want you to focus on. So recall of key facts, retrieval practice, lots and lots of things like that is the key for this half term. Um, I'm gonna be doing loads and loads of stuff. We've got like about 20 lives a week that are going out, live for business lessons that are going out there a week. We've got loads more subjects coming on, so we've got sociology, we've got psychology, potentially history, further maths, um, to really, really help you guys with your revision. So I am gonna be here with you every single step of the way. Ouch! This is why in some videos I explain scratches. <laughs>